going on live fans again and we are back with another play now online game and uh i enjoyed that game a lot yesterday so i want to go ahead and put up another one let's see if we can get another win but we're going to try a different team that i haven't used before so uh yeah so right now i'm two and oh i know y'all like nigga two and oh but i mean when it comes to leaderboards like when i look at these leaderboards check this out and 2k has the same problem when it comes oh you see me down at the bottom i'm two and oh but if you look at the top 100 and you see their records like okay i understand why this lord asap mama guy he's number one because i mean he, he put the work in but when you go down here to like what number nine who is it spunk vader how the hell is he or she ninth on the leaderboard on the all-time leaderboard when he pretty much got 100 losses more than they had wins and that's what 2k has a problem with it i think it goes by the, the amount of games that you have played so far they don't go about by the amount of wins but yeah so they go on just strictly off the amount of games you have played not the amount of games you have won i think the games you have won factors in it a little bit but the leaderboards has been jacked up for years where they just go off that. Wizards versus the Rockets, man. Let's get it. Alright, man, here we go. I need to change my camera to start the game though, because I mean I like my broadcast cam. I think live they go by baseline as far as their camera, the camera that I like, you know, showing from the side. But it, it doesn't show too much of the court, so I need to see if it's possible for me to zoom out a little bit. You already know who we gotta watch for. James Harden, punk ass. Let's go. Oh, they already got it in this angle, so I'm just leave it. Nah, let's go. What? Alright, whatever. Come on, Michael Beasley. Did I just call this nigga Michael Beasley? That's Bill. Y'all, I know my NBA players. I promise I do. Oh, God. He, he held that too long. Go ahead, Porter. Nah. Let's get into Gortat. Polish Hammer. And one. The Polish Hammer. Bruh. PJ Tucker. Oh, come on, my nigga. Oh, God. You give me that highlight dunking. All right. Uh, I, shit. Fuck. 76ers versus the Wizards. All right, I know we're just going to dump it down into MB. All right, man, we already know he's going to try to dump it down into MB. We ain't worried about... I'm not worried about uh, Simmons because the nigga ain't got no shot, but sometimes the, the interior defense can get pretty trash, so I know I got to be up on it when it comes to my interior defense. All right, man, let's see if we can finish this. Oh, that's too much space. Let's go. Give him space. That's an one? Oh, my God, man. Come on, bro. One free throw to come. Terrible at the free throw line, though. Get the rebound. Let's go. Green. Let's go. Go ahead. Green again, baby. We'll take those long tools. But you got to step behind that damn three-point line, though. Good solid entry pass. We ain't worried about that. Why is this nigga? This nigga doing splits. What? I mean, what really caused that? Can I replay that? I can't. To the basket, even when being fouled hard. So he hits the first and misses the second. To Sessions. Lots of room there. That's good. Jody Meeks. He did that for the Lakers, baby. Let's go. Shut up, Venom. I can hear you now. I already talking about I'm saying. He said I say let's go all the time. 
You might ask, why are you settling for a three? It's not a settle. That's a step up. Damn, nigga just push me out of the way, man. It's a loose ball. Give me that. They turn it over. Go ahead, all the way. God damn. Okay, John Waters, how you feel? And all that damn traffic. He got right to the rim in this close oh, shit. Touchdown. I couldn't stop the ball, man. Washington's all right, we had halftime. We only up by two. I just went cold in that second quarter, man. I really couldn't hear shit. What are we shooting? 11 for 25. One for three from three. All right, man. We got to have a... Uh, what the fuck? Well, nigga, what? All right, we got to have a, a better third quarter. Seriously. Oh, you reaching. Washington's got a slim lead. Good put back. The Polish hammer, man. Thank you, because my... Damn, that shot release was so damn early. We there. Oh, my... Uh, really? A... See, this is what I'm saying, man. Like, he just... Oh, my God. Second team foul. It's hard to score in this league. Bruh. Are you? <laughs> NBA Live, bro. Y'all, y'all trash, bro. Y'all are trash. EA, y'all are trash. Y'all are seriously trash. Like, why did I even waste my time playing this? Live fans, I would stand corrected if the game just, if the guy just lagged out, then I would say that I'm wrong. That he just he, he just quit the game. I don't see why he would rage quit if the game was so close. We were just going back and forth at the time of the game drop or he quit. But I, I, that's why I'm saying I don't see why he would quit. But if he did quit, I would stand corrected. If not, I would say that this game online is trash when it comes to head to head. It doesn't make any sense how terrible this game is, man. But if the guy did quit, I don't want to see connection to Pierre has been lost because that's the same message that y'all send when the game is just being dropped out of nowhere. When the game just been dropped from the service, it, it gave me the same message. The connection to your period has been lost. So, you know, I, I don't want to see that whenever a guy quits the game. You know, when it comes to 2K, it'll tell you your opponent has left the match. You know, and then if the game just dropped, if the service is just terrible on 2K at the time, it will say something like uh, your connection to our online, to our service has been lost or something like that. Check your connection. Like, it's your damn fault. 2K I always blame they rag their service on your connection. Like, check your but like bitch, I got some good ass connections. There's no way in the hell that this game gonna drop and it's my fault. But that's what it is, man. I, I really hate that that game dropped because it was a fun game. Uh when I play live, really, live, I play live to, to have fun. When it comes to 2K, I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm gonna tell you the difference between the two. When it comes to 2K, you have to be a little bit more skillful and take better shots than you do on live. I'm just being honest, it's a little bit more sim when it comes to head to head. A lot of BS happens in uh, Play Now Online when it comes to 2K, but you get away with it a whole lot more when you play live head to head. Because some of these shots that I would attempt, or some of these layups or dunks that I try to attempt, those shits will not fly in 2K. Like, you have to be a little bit more skillful whenever you play head to head. Uh, on 2K, so I really come to live to have fun. This is a more fun game. It's not as serious as 2K. On 2K, I'm I'm pretty much on try hard mode whenever I'm playing uh, play now online because I really want to win. When I come to NBA Live, it's just a fun. I can just sit back, chill out, and just play the game, you know. So uh, it, it gives me two different feels, and that's what I like about NBA Live and 2K. They give you two different feels. One game I feel like is it's a a game to have fun on they just really do what you want to do and the other one you just have to just sit back and plan out what you're going to do and adjust to what your opponent is doing you know when it comes to this i feel like guys just run to the basket head first and just try to get a contested layup to go in or a dunk or some type of animation and get the shot to go or they get a foul call but 2k that's not gonna happen so yeah man it's your boy sean i'm gonna go ahead and sign out man y'all have a good one. Yeah.